Hello everybody, West Country Explorer here. Now I'm doing an impromptu video in a little village called Wayford in Somerset. Basically what it is, I've come over this way to do a few other videos, like in the West Dorset area. Caught the train down to Crookham and I was, as I, was, I was cycling along the main road out of Crookham, sort of down towards sort of like the main A35. And Wayford just off of the that main road and for many 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 years I've passed a little sign pointing to Wayford advertising the fact like the 13th century church I've often thought quite like to come have a look at this little church and today as I was cycling along sort of to do these other videos I thought stop it let's come and have a look at this church and the little village Oh, excuse me, Bramble. And like I said, I'm going to do an impromptu video here of the village and the church. So, guys, hope you enjoy. Right, so, the village is a bit of a dead end, it's at the top of a bit of a hill. So uh, the only people that sort of really come down this way would be people sort of come into the village for a specific reason. It's not a free road. Now I don't know anything much about the village. Like I said, it was just an impromptu come here to do some recording. But I mean, I've already had a little look around the church. And one thing I've learned is about a local family called the Vincent family. Who like came to prominence in the 1600s. I'll just show you this a sec. Look at that. Looks in here. Morning. one of these telephone boxes that have been turned into a little library. Yeah, I think that's the old manor house through that. But anyway, yeah, the Vincent family, as I was saying, they came into prominence in the six, early 1600s in this village. There's the 13th century church. I'm going to go inside, but not quite as impressive outside as I was expecting it to be. So the Vincent family, they were wheelwrights and became quite prosperous doing that wheelwright. So much so that after a while, I think it was in the 1800s, they'd outgrown their premises here. So they moved down the road to Clapton, which is a village on the main road from Crookham down to the A35. And they had premises there. And I think some of them also, some of the Vincent family also owned the Blue Boy pub down in Clapton. Of course, with the advent of motor cars and all the rest, that kind of motorised vehicles, real rights sort of fell out of fashion. So obviously, people getting cars and all the rest. So some members of the Vincent family moved over to America and started working for Henry Ford, making wheels for cars. Obviously, some members of the Vincent family stayed in this area. I think they've built up a bit of an empire around the Yeovil area, from what I've heard. Yeah. 
So here we have the inside of the church. To my mind, this is more impressive than the outside. Old fashioned pews. Oh, I mean, oh, look. The big yard. Probably getting close enough. Feel free to pause if you want to read it. About the woods as well. Just over here, this is where I was reading about the Vincent family. There you go, feel free to pause and read if you want to. Little kitchen area through there, just roped off. Yeah, it's uh, quite a nice little church. Inside, I, I think the inside's much nicer than the outside. I think the outside's been plastered over. What well, I'm not sure what that material's called. I, I do, I do know the word is in, stuck in my brain somewhere. I just can't think what it's called. But I think sort of the coat, coating on the outside of the wall is a later addition. I thought. You guys know what I'm trying to say. Oh, so there we go. So there you go, guys. That was just a little impromptu visit to Wayford. Oh, I admit, that's it. Light coming in, sunlight coming in through the window there. So, yeah, I thought impromptu video sort of i just done this with like no planning or forethought or anything like that but just yeah i couldn't resist doing it guys so hope you've enjoyed watching and yeah like i said i'm off to do the next video i'm off to betiscam for those of you that don't know betiscam it's got lovely interesting stories attached to it to the manor house about screaming skulls so yes, guys, it's going to be interesting. Look forward to seeing you in that video if you want to watch it. And in the meantime, stay safe, take care, and God bless.